Hey guys, Animal Man here. It's the beginning of spring. We've had the first warm spring rains, which has triggered the annual spotted salamander migration. It's a once in a year phenomena. I'm gonna share it with you tonight. Stay with us. So we're almost there guys, you can hear the peepers. Spring peepers are a sure sign we're at the vernal pool. So this is a really, really cool area. So we're along a natural gas pipeline in a town near my house. I've been coming here for years to experience this. And the vernal pool is a very special place for amphibians. This is for local salamanders and frogs and toads. But what's special about these pools is that these little critters use these every year go back to the same place where they were born to have their babies and the vernal pool is cool because it only holds water seasonally at the end of the winter after all the snow melts it gets all the runoff it fills up these areas with water and that gives amphibians the perfect habitat to lay their eggs because by the end of the summer the water is going to dry up and there are no year-round predators here so right there that's in their favor uh, here's where the swamp starts, right in here. See all these reeds and cattails. There's a spring peeper right there. See if he'll call for us. You guys ready for this? Check out how small this frog is. It's like the size of a dime, watch. That's a spring peeper. Boop. And here's a frog who showed up for the party. See if we can find anybody over in here. Come on. <laughs> oh, come on, dude. Right there. First spotted salamander of the season. Here he is. Oh, isn't he cool? Hey, buddy. On his way down to the pool to breed. on their way to the vernal pool right now. Here's one of the salamander egg masses right there. It's pretty cool. These are all over the place in here.
So hopefully you guys can make this out. You see in the water, all those little things look like little boogers. Those are the leftover sperm packets from the males. So what happens is every spring, when you get the first warm spring rains, like a big rainstorm, where it's above freezing during the day and sometimes below freezing at night, it triggers these spotted salamanders to migrate to this vernal pool. And they form a huge breeding ball of males called the Congress. And it's kind of like, you know, a human Congress, like they all get together, screw around, only a few of them get anything done. Yep, just like that. <laughs> so what happens is the males, each in their mating frenzy, they each drop one of these sperm plugs and the female then will come over here and she'll select which one and she'll she'll take it into her cloaca and then fertilize her eggs and, and fertilize the eggs that she lays them. So most of these go to waste. All the ones here are ones that were not selected by the female. So these are males that maybe will have better luck next year. But it's pretty cool. You can tell, you know, this is the scene, scene of the crime. Let me show this to you. That's what they look like. I'm touching salamander sperm. Pretty freaking gross. Meh.